Hi, how are you guys doing? This is Jonathan. Today we're going to feature yet another Tom Anderson guitar. This is the Tom Anderson Classic S Shoreline Go.
If you're new to this channel, you might just want to subscribe to this channel and press the bell for notification of future videos that follow and be part of the patrons to support this channel. I would appreciate it. I want to thank again Joseph Chong, my friend, for passing me this guitar. He has two Tom Anderson. Uh, the other one was featured a couple of videos ago. That was the Icon Classic, or the Classic Icon. Well, basically about the same. Um, as you all know, Tom Anderson does custom builds. So in their website, there is a form where you can stipulate what you want for your guitar and they'll build it for you. What we have here is a outer body and a maple neck in a vintage tinted satin finish. This of course is the shoreline gold finish. Really nice. Right. Um, not much of a um, information on the specification. You have locking tuners. Right. You have the bus fitting uh, system again. So I just found out that the uh, bus fitting uh, system consists of shifting the nut a little bit closer forward. 
Uh, you have a string tree, Tom Anderson logo. All right. Uh, these are not jumbo frets, I guess. These are like I think thin, thin and tall, something like that. Uh, yeah, black dot markers. All right. Uh, I'm gonna look at the uh, specs, uh, specification here. Yes, you have a medium fret, sorry, even tapered, right? And then uh, chrome vintage tremolo system here, right? Screwed in. For the pickup system, you have the SC1 for the uh, neck and the medium, and then you have a H2 for the humbucker, non-covered. Uh, you have a H white finish on the covers of the single coil. And then uh, you have a five-way pickup system. Now this is interesting, it gets interesting. You have a, a splitter right here. This is a toggle switch. It lets you split the uh, humbucker right here. Really interesting, you know, you, you get really nice tones out of this. Um, the, of course, the neck again has a two uh, screw joint. Now, I found out that they have a very intricate joint system that um, makes it real stable. Uh, Joseph was telling me that uh, Tom Edison actually did uh, demonstrate doing <laughs> pull up with this, uh, with this neck, you know, so it must be really, really strong. Um, okay, so how does it play? Now, I do not know about this uh, neck profile. It's like a slim C or, or a slim D, you know. Really easy, uh, really easy on the neck. Um, you can, yeah, and, and the action is pretty nice too. You know, you have a, uh, this I think is not a bone neck, you know, uh, I might be mistaken. The, the other one consists of the same neck. I think this is a test, a white test net, if I'm not mistaken. Um, the vintage tremolo system is really nice, uh, stays in tune. Um, again, the pickups are really interesting. You have the SC1, which is the same as the Icon Classic uh, previously. Really nice single call tones. And then the humbucker for this is a little bit more than sounding than the other one. Um, the other one has a plus one, if I'm not mistaken, so it has a little bit more output. This is just nice. This, I, I think, is um, really. Um, how should I say it? Really meaty. Yeah, M-E-T-E-A-T-Y. <laughs> um, it has a nice mid-range with harmonics in it. You know, you, you, you can hear the harmonic content of this pickup. And um, it's it's meant for, yeah, you can tell that this, this guitar is meant for soloing. Um, really nice um, feel to it when you're doing lines. Uh, not much of an effort, you know, really nice um, action. I know that uh, Joe uh, Joseph likes radio action, but this is this is just nice. This is just nice for me. You know? Yeah, cool. Um, again, belly cut um, compartment here for access to your switches and and your tremolo arm and your tremolo block. Where you, and I think changing string with this is really easy. I I, I actually changed a new set of uh, SIT uh, power grooves. Um, without even taking off that back cover, so it's, it's really easy. Nice. Let me know what you think about this guitar and leave the comments in the comment section down below. I want to hear from you. And uh, again, like the other video, I'm still learning. I'm not saying that I know everything, so there's certain um, facts that I do not get right. Um, it would be good for you guys to share and um, yeah, be nice about it. You know, sometimes. I mean, we don't know everything, so I think a little grace goes a long way. So let me know what you think about this guitar and leave your comments in the comment section down below. Uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, press that bell for notification of future videos that follow, and be part of patrons to support this channel. I would appreciate it. I want to thank all my patrons for the wonderful love, the friendship, and the support. Thank you so much, guys. In the meantime, you guys, please take care of yourself, and I'll see you real soon. Take care of yourself. Ciao.